Hi guys. So I'm here at Reefapalooza. Hopefully it's not too hard to hear me. <laughs> uh, my family members and stuff. Well, my in-laws, family members. My in-laws, in-laws? I don't know, whatever. Uh, yeah, so we're here at Reefapalooza in California, 2018. been super awesome so far. Are you enjoying the show? Yeah. <laughs> awesome! Showing everybody on, on YouTube how awesome it is. <laughs> so yeah, I've been wandering around looking at a bunch of stuff. We kind of did a full tour of everything already. Um, so I wanted to come online and just like chat and see how you guys were doing. Show off what I see so far. So I guess I uh, will walk up to the front and we'll kind of start from the beginning and do like a walkthrough. Uh, lots of stuff going on. Lots of people. which is right out front of the main entrance. We have I'm gonna start at the doors and kind of walk through so you can see but this is this is us it's much smaller than the other ones that I've seen like online yeah it's good so far can you hear me okay let me do one of these okay perfect awesome so yeah I figured I'd give kind of a walkthrough of what what I see as I'm going through. I've already done a full walkthrough of everything, kind of scoped everything out. I think I'm gonna probably buy most of my stuff tomorrow because there's nothing super high-end that I wanted to get. Uh, most crazy thing I've seen so far is an anemone that's worth like $2,500. I want this right here. This, this is my future tank. This is the 66 gallon. I love it so much. It comes with the sump and all of that. You guys should do what I did. <laughs> oh, you video? Yes. It's super awesome. I love the setups. So they have like cutouts on the back so you can see what the uh, piping and everything looks like. It's not a raffle, unfortunately. I wish it was, but he is selling that one off for 650 bucks if you take it from Reefapalooza as it is. And then he's got a sale going on on them for 850 with the stand, where normally it's like $1,200. So I wanna get it, but the hubby said no, just because I need all the other kit and everything to go with it. And he's like, it's gonna take you a while before you get it set up. You don't wanna be wasting warranty, so we'll worry about it next year, which sucks. Hey, oh, how are you? So this is my LFS's stand. They're super awesome. You can check them out online. They do have a uh, coral they sell online as well, which is uh, sandbar coral shops. But this is a sandbar pet shop. They've got all their stuff here. The, the guy with the long hair right there, that's Eric. He's the owner, super, super cool dude. He's the one who helped me through that whole like emotional turmoil of trying to get my fish. And then we got some awesome vendors. I wish I had like a um, orange filter for you guys so that everything wouldn't look quite so blue. I should probably buy one. They have them for sale over there. I got testing kits. Age of Aquariums, it's like a 
local pet shop, not super local, they're like up in LA, but they've got all their tanks and systems out too. I can walk you right, guys around. Last call for our next speaker of the day, Joe Caparata, owner of Unique Morals. Joe Cap. They're going to talk about building a commercial facility. Sorry, the speaker announcements are really, really loud. I'll walk you guys out so that you guys can see the raffle prizes as well. Most of the good raffles are tomorrow, so I'll be back again tomorrow because they have the tank raffles tomorrow. I did, I'm trying to win lights. Because, so, my idea behind it is if I can win the lights today, then that's one less thing I would have to pay for. At which point, buying that tank for 650, which is such a great deal, is not that big of a deal because then it's really just the sand and the rock and stuff like that, which isn't as expensive. We all know that the lights are like crazy. Let me go walk you through all the raffles that they have out here. And then we'll come back in and tour the rest of all that. Uh, that's SCA, so. These guys. Yeah. So this is their 120 right here. Which has like gorgeous, some nice space. And then they have a 50 cube and a 45 cube. So this is the 50 cube and the 45 is on the other side. And then they have the 66 in the middle. walk out this way. It's much quieter out here. Yeah, so I have the benefit that they're literally just up the freeway from me. I could probably go pick my tank up from them. In fact, if I did, they'd probably knock some of the price off because even though they have free shipping, they have to like freight it. Um, but yeah. <laughs> And then we got all the raffles. So, so far I put in some for Two Guys Corals. Ooh, they have Magna Passes out now. I should do that one. I did the Protein Skimmer. They've got water analysis stuff. I did some on the um, Peninsula Tank. Go this way around the corner. So I did these babies. The XR30s, I put raffle ticket on those. I put a raffle ticket on, on the Nero. Did some on the MP40s. Tomorrow they're giving away that crazy one. Uh, I know. It's basically all the gear is what I'm trying to really kit out because I'm like, if I if I could get the gear, then I don't have to worry about the rest of everything. So, over here, they got an RODI, so I did that. I, I have three sheets of tickets. I actually still have like 32 tickets to put in. I need to go put more in on, especially on those lights. Like, I'm like, if I can just if I can win the lights and like the skimmer, although the one, the tank that's in there, the 650, that comes with the plumbing, that comes with the skimmer, that comes with a pump. So like, even though I would want to upgrade them at some point, all of that stuff is part of that pack and play kit. So I shouldn't have to worry about it. And then over here, they've got like all the gift cards and like um, frag packs and that kind of stuff. Yeah, the sump is nice. I put some on that one too. Then they have a ATO down here, little teeny tiny aquarium. And then the hot pink ATO. Yeah. 
so it's it's been fun so far like it's, it's been a lot of stuff to see I just don't know what I want to get I'm still trying to figure out what I want to put in that top corner in the tank because um, I don't know what's gonna really survive super well there and obviously yeah I mean there's a ton of nice stuff Nothing that super like stands out to me. There's a lot of really expensive things that I will never buy, or at least not until I have better tank, better lighting. Um, the I haven't bought anything. We've just been walking around. I'm gonna be back tomorrow though too. So like like I said, nothing that I um, am like super worried about is like selling out like crazy. So let's go down this way. Thank you, Mage. I appreciate it. Especially because this is the new, like, fish specific channel, so I have, like, no subs on it. <laughs> so, this is a Kessel booth. I stopped over and talked to the AI guys, too. They were super cool. Getting to see the new Nero pump in action was awesome. Based on the fact that I've got pretty much just LPS and, like, my softies, they said that the two primes should be okay over that size of tank that I was looking at, so. We got these guys. So these guys were at the frag swap that I went to earlier this year that I told you guys about. Their stuff has been super pretty. I can go show you to you. Oh, let's take a walk over to the AI booth. Yes, I can ask them how much the new lights are for the Kessel. Hold on. Let's walk this way. So start with AI. All right. So that's the new Nero pump right there. So it looks like it's got some pretty good movement on it. And then they were showing me how it like swivels on the mount so that you can kind of point it to where you want to go, which was really cool. Um, but yeah, I mean, based on everything that's in the tank, everything looks like it's getting good movement. <laughs> just the internet, just YouTube, you know. I have some people that were asking me about the Nero. They wanted to see it. So I was like, I went over and looked at it earlier. Let me go back and show you. Yeah. Good flow. I like it. I think it's cool. It has a weird sound. Uh, I mean, it depends. Some of the booths are, you know, like 10 bucks, 15 bucks. Got quite a few of them that are doing like multi-packs and stuff like that. Uh, but then I've seen some that, you know, the frags are, you know, 200, 300, 500 dollars, which is not necessarily the corals that I usually go for because I'm not super into the acros myself. It's mostly, you know, the, um, euphilia and stuff like that there was one like orange euphilia that i saw over at one of the other booths that was i think he said 250 a head or something like that i don't i don't even know yeah that's why i haven't bought anything because like i said nothing that i'm like super like worried about is on sale today so all right we're back at kessel i'll ask him in a minute Are these the new ones, Mage? Yeah, you're welcome. I have a question. How much are the new Kessel lights? $449. $449? Okay. There you go, Mage. Now you know. <laughs> are these these ones here? Beautiful. Awesome. The coloring is gorgeous. I like the shimmer on it, too. <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah, no, it's not terrible at all. And they look like they throw off good color. He's only got two on this huge tank, so. Looks like a pretty decent, decent size. Try to be careful of where I film so that I'm not, you know, filming people without their permission. Oh, wow, I didn't know. 
I mean, the coloring on them looks good, and it doesn't look like that he's got them up that high. And then we got Brightwell here, showing off all their stuff. Of course, we have eShops. We got a Red Sea booth over here. I'm gonna go down this way. Because I actually, this is the one aisle that I have not gone down. They have Margot Rocks here. We've got some Triton stuff, which is awesome. I'm gonna come back and talk to them a little later. And then I was interested to see this, because that's the random flow nozzle. They're giving one of these away in the raffle. I put a ticket in on this too. Because you can kind of see the, the flow patterns. Is Triton still leaking? I didn't know Triton was leaking. I obviously did not pay attention. Oh, that's the new controller boards that I saw on the website. That looks nice. It's very clean. Oh, like those cartons there? The like milk jugs? <coughs> yeah, and that's what I was looking at. I was looking at getting two of the AI Primes when I stopped over and talked to them earlier. Like, I, I like how they look, so. That's true, the Prime definitely did not have the shimmer, like, when you're, when you're looking at it. I mean, it, it still has shimmer, it's just definitely not as intense. the Red Sea tank over here. I mean, if you upgrade your castles and you don't want them anymore, <laughs> I know someone who will take them free off of your hands. And then we got two guys corals over here and all their stuff. And then solar, which I wish I could have, but I live in a condo, so I can't. But I would love to be able to run my fish tank off of solar. <laughs> and then over here we have the Reef to Reef booth. So they're raffling off this little red sea, and then they've got uh, one of the auto top off kits that they're gonna be raffling off, and some gift cards and all that kind of stuff. So that raffle is happening tomorrow. So if you are here today or you're gonna be here tomorrow, you have to be here tomorrow at like two, and they're gonna do those raffles, uh, give those away. But I was actually super lucky. I got um, a little tank cleaning towel too. And then over here, PCH tank is doing some demos on how to build aquascapes. So they've got all kinds of different scapes that they've been building using the Marco rocks, which are coming out really cool. And then we got the carob sea stuff. Last year I got a huge piece of rock from them. I'm very excited that whenever I finally get my bigger tank, I can put that in. We have a coral life, an aquion over here, showing off their stuff. Dr. Tim, he's actually gonna be doing a panel, I think tomorrow, talking about his methods and stuff like that. I used this, the one and only, to help cycle my tank when I first started it up. 
and we have the aqua effects. My daughter loved this. We walked over, she saw it, and she was like, ooh. She thought it was real neat. <laughs> Hi, Buddha. How are you? Oh, it smells like food. I'm hungry. Then we got current. So they're showing off uh, here their freshwater lights, the new ones that they just released. So they have a new uh, coloring system for the freshwater stuff, which is really pretty. I think it's cool how it cycles through the lights. You can change them just like the current um, stuff all through the loop app. Control which light colors you have on it. That kind of stuff. And then we have Crystal Dynamics and their tanks, which are gorgeous. Hi, how are you? They're giving this one away tomorrow. Maybe I'll win it. That would be beautiful. And then, oops. Go well, this way. We got JBJ over here. <laughs> Selling fish directly out of their tank. And then showing off like the power of their pumps. So yeah, anything in particular you guys would like to see that I can walk you guys towards? That's that's kind of the whole show. It's it's little. You've now seen the whole thing, other than like what's in the specific aquariums. Uh, we got. Magna here. They're selling the little frag holders that are actually engraved with Magna on it. So I have to come back and get one of those. 30 bucks, not a bad deal at all. And then we have Lifeguard. Their little all in one tanks are so cute. And then over in the corner, we have my hubby and his brother and my sleeping baby. Which concludes our tour. <laughs> so yeah, that that's kind of what we got going on. Um, I will do another like brief live stream tomorrow because obviously there will be more raffles and I'll let you know if I see anything crazy or awesome or whatever. I'm gonna probably try to find some lunch because now that I've smelled it, I'm starving. And then see about what I want to buy, which is, Legit, I want to buy all the things, but maybe I'll win some tanks or some lights or something. I got to go put the rest of my tickets in on those raffles too, so. I will talk to you guys later. Thanks for joining me. Oh, yeah. I would like to go to Macna at some point. I just haven't gone yet, so. It would be cool at some point to head down. Is The next, the next one's in Orlando, right? Sleeping baby. In there somewhere. To the sleep. Next year, yes. Come. Next year we'll hang out. We'll go to Disneyland and we'll hang out at, at Reef Palooza. I like the new venue. It's a lot bigger. Like last year, this was even smaller. They probably had like maybe two thirds of what they have in here right now. The only thing I'm disappointed is the one vendor that I super love, which is VW Reefs, isn't here this year, so. But the other one that I liked, the Your Corals, they've got some nice stuff. So we'll go back through and see what I want to buy, see if there's anything imperative that I need to have like today. And if not, we'll just wait till tomorrow. I want to go back to the Crystal Dynamics place and see how I win that tank tomorrow. Hopefully it's just all raffles and then I will buy literally all the raffle sheets tomorrow and try to win it. So yeah, I'm gonna go wander around and stuff. Thanks again, I'll see you guys later, bye.